Brothers and sisters, comrades and friends, my name is Cuba Libre, and welcome back to Let's Play Unreal. This is the Bluff Ever Smoking. We just dropped a Titan, a Stone Titan, into some motherfucker. Oh no, you were. Oh, I already know what you're gonna do. No, 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 you are not gonna run to your death. Who's out in front of you? Who's out in front of you? Okay, all right. Yeah, I'll follow you then. Oh god. Don't be a fool. Is it is it done? Oh, I see a trap. I saved them. I didn't even take that much damage. No armor, and there's a fruit right there, so. Okay, well, I know where the switch is now, thanks. Oh, and you can see I got that. Uh, I couldn't even talk about this when I got it because the stowed titan woke up. But I got another disruptor upgrade, so now it shoots. God, what is that? Five at a time? Looks like. Let's go all the way back here. Check this out. I don't know. Ah, I knew it. Security Officer Sergei Dubrov, ISV Kron Log Entry. We are hot on the trail of the Scourge hunting party that captured Kira near the Sun Spire. They are headed north towards the blue electrical storms on the horizon. So they sent a rescue mission and they all got slaughtered, it looks like. By whom? That's a good question. ISVCon Chief Medical Officer Log, Tatiana Zimna. We got uh, bones over here. We have come to this beautiful Canyon Lake Monastery in our search for Kira's abductors. We'll make camp by this crucifix tonight and start out early tomorrow. No, you won't. That is just too bad. You guys should know better. You really ought to know better. It is quite pretty, though. I wish I could see. Oh, look at the. Whoa! Do you see that? Hold on. Let me get. Let's see if I can get a better view from over, up here. But that is kind of creepy. <laughs> uh, oh. The birds here are apparently. Well, whatever. They're made out of darts. I wonder if there's a. Oh, I didn't actually die. Thank you, Unreal Gods, for not just straight killing me. Except, uh, now I'm gonna die. <laughs> That's a horrible way down. Oh, man. Okay, alright. Well, I'll be back in a second. <laughs> Alright, peeps, I'm back, but let me... I want you to show you this. Oh, I didn't get this yet. You see that guy? I don't know if you can see it, but I'll zoom in with the sniper rifle. Like, a crucified Nolly all the way the fuck over there. I wonder, he must have been somebody important, because they sure were pissed off at him. Jesus. I just know they're gonna throw something from behind. So, this monastery is really awesome looking. There's a path running down to the cliff. Look at this. Talk about exploration. Holy craps. Okay, that's a praying nolly. Oops. <laughs> well, it's not like I don't have more where that came from. I literally cannot kill these guys any faster.
What was I supposed to do? It is interesting how all enemies just wait around standing directly next to Nolly until <laughs> you pop your head in. Very obvious trigger kind of hurts the uh, believability of the world as an independent place, but you know, whatever. You are getting knocked off. <clears throat> You are dead. Ooh. Someone was sniping in the corner over here. Very clever. I mean, I guess not clever enough. Oh, hello. And those guys are cake. If I could just fight those guys all the time, that would be fantastic. Oh, a water entrance, so I can go in through the cistern. There's that ramp along the side. There's, uh... This little cage of... Dear buddies. Hey, buddies. Aww. It's obviously the little farm out here. It's how they eat and live. Monasteries are usually, in real life, self-sufficient. This fucking Nolly is... Oh man, that's a long way down. That Nolly is totally gonna get dead. Oh my god, it's a ghost. Do you s I don't know if you guys can see this, but that's totally a, a ghost. Vault of the Dead. Herein lies the last resting place for the High Priest of Bluff Ever Smoking and the artifacts used by the Messiah. Okay. Only by facing the direction of the rising sun may one find a new day. Okay, well... The, mm. Well, this is very interesting. Obviously, this is some sort of puzzle. Son of Nalan Garas, 380 to 390. Acolyte Dalin Garas. High Priests. Acolyte, blah de blah. Pellet Jan. Pellet. January 20th, 1997 to July 17th, 1997. Okay, so obviously that must be a developer something. One of their pets or something. Misha. Aw, Misha the sled dog. November 20th, 1994 to June 1997. Aw. Only... Oh. Oh. I decided to run into the actual... Whoa. The Tomb of the High Priest opened. Oh man, well... Gah! No! No! Okay, first I'm gonna ride this back up and grab all those flak shells. That's alright with you. Look, there's a way through there. This is fucking... This place, man. This is the real ass deal right here. Oh no, it went back up. Without me. Okay, yeah. I like when they have actual ghosts. I mean, actual knowledge that you really need to help you. They make them ghosts, so, so you can't die. I mean, so they can't die. That kind of cracks me up. Oh, he's opening all the coffins for me. Is 
This must be all the bonus junk. Got anyone? No, now he's now the ghost is coughing. Soul coughing. Oh, ho, ho. So there's nothing amazing, just like, you know, ammo and stuff, but still, it's a lot of free gear. Oh, I could definitely use ASMD stuff. I would have loved those flax shells. I guess if I ever find a way out of here, I can go back around. This weird little alcove for no reason. Okay. Up the stairs. Let's see what's in here. A bio rifle. Very good. <laughs> and invisibility. Very good. Another random alcove. Okay. Okay, so it looks like the only way out of here is through the pipe. Apparently I have scuba gear, because I'm hearing it on run. Oh, and this is this. Okay. I guess it's just if you come in from that direction, the ghost isn't down there to open all this shit up for you. Is my guess. So this whole top part was just one big bonus joint. Okay. I can deal with that. I can totally deal with that. So I guess... We gotta go down this way. And actually, before we begin this, I will resync. Back in action. Back in action. One man. Just seeing if I can't snipe off any uh, unsuspecting enemies. Jesus, a whole light tower. We see the crucifix, the Nolly crucifix, carved into the side. It's pretty cool. This must got to be some kind of tra tram system. There it is. You can ride that around those rails. Interesting. Oh, one of those assholes. Ow, dick. Ooh, and he fell off dead. That sucks. Nothing. Another one of these douchebags. Oh god. A little more effective when he runs right the hell up on ya. Okay. I don't know if you saw that, but the disruptor bolt just went through and blew up both those barrels. Maybe that's another... Maybe get piercing of some kind? Shipping log. Grork of the Red Hand Tribe. So... Tribal warlike culture. Scourge. Anyways. Coming the next full moon, we are expecting a large shipment of salvage supplies from the human spacecraft. I need to make a few repairs to the electric rails around the bluff, but we should be ready by then. So, it looks like... The Scourge might have installed the railway. Another shipping log. I am really getting sick with the way the Scourge are treating us. Oh, this guy is not Scourge. Constantly bossing us around and making us watch over their pathetic Nolly slaves. My troops are getting sick of this situation. So, I saw in a FAQ online that the, uh... Those dudes that shoot you... Maybe, maybe it's these guys that are the tribe. So they're another race just hired by the Scourge. But those dudes with, like, the shields are called, uh, mercenaries. So I don't know how literally that is to be taken, but it sounds like pretty. <laughs> pretty literally. Ooh. That does not look pleasant, man. Still don't know whether I should be putting those guys up in their misery or not. That is a headless nolly. That's rough. Interesting. 
sewer vents out the side of the cliff. See, it's all these little side passages that games are missing nowadays. All these fucking linear ass bullshit games. Another dead Valley under. Ugh. Like that Medal of Honor game that I played, that I let's played. The new one came out, guys. It's called Warfighter. And it sounds fantastic. Might just have to pirate that one and LP it as well. Just for comedy value. Holy shit. So what is my best? Unfortunately, you don't really have that much in the way of great, uh. <laughs> oh, that works. Oh, that works so well. Bring it. Bring it, assholes. Oh, God. Ow. Don't bring it like that, though. Don't bring it like where you actually hit me. Yes. It was a brutal smackdown. Interesting. More dice. I was playing dice in the alley. Obviously, you right, walked up. He's like, "Yo, I thought I told you." I was like, "Yo, whatever." All right, let's. Before we get too far here, let me. Uh, <clears throat> Jailer Hrang of the Red Hand Tribe. I can't believe it. That Terran girl escaped. One of those worthless Nali monks must have helped her out. I am in deep shit. If Captain Duk Charoth comes and finds out I let her escape, I'll be D Rangod for sure. Hilarious alien gonad joke. Doro owes me 25,000 gold paras when we get home. He truly sucks at death bones. Hustling him is like taking candy from a Terran baby. Speaking of which, I think it's time to go beat on that ugly Terran girl somewhere. So obviously this Kira chick, they brought her here, but she escaped. We have captured a Terran girl. I should have done it right to left, huh? Some of my soldiers want to try and take liberties with her. I guess that's okay as long as they watch those boots. She kicked... My in the frangos last time. Oh wow, they really are want to make sure that you understand that they're talking about alien gun ads. It's very important. What would they even? They're like fish dudes from another galaxy. Like what sexual interest could they even have? I don't know. I guess human dudes want to fantasize about alien chicks sometimes. Not me. Not not me, of course. Croon's personal diary. I have to be careful how many times I sneak into the monastery through the tunnels. I've marked the tunnel that leads to the inner monastery with a cross. The other leads to the prison where my brother is still being held. Okay, so we got a whole underground railroad thing going on here. I discovered a secret! Last night I snuck out of my hiding place and swam through the pipes of the prison. They have captured a girl! A crawl sergeant... Crawl. That was what they are called, these fish dudes. Took two boots in the mouth when he approached her. Ha ha, I can only laugh at their stupidity. Wait. The crawl guy was talking about... He took boots in the gonads. Frangos or whatever. And this said in the mouth. Are there gonads in their mouths? The woman they captured is scheduled to be executed. I cannot let this happen. As foolish as it sounds, I will attempt to sneak her out of the prison cell through our secret caves. From there she can escape to the bell tower until darkness. So that's pretty much where I've got to go. Obviously, the bell tower is sort of in the back end of all this. So this is just his little hideout, I guess. Have faith, and never sway from your beliefs. Only a soul that keeps the faith despite all oppression shall triumph when the Savior Princess comes from the stars. Savior Princess? They must be talking about me. Oh, another book. I've been hiding here for what seems like months now. The Scarge forces that have taken over our monastery continue to transport stolen Teridium and other strange mechanical devices using their lightning sled. I fear that they may find me. Is this whole little underground railroad thing going on? Okay, so that's to the inner monastery. The other one is to the prison, which is where I was came from originally. Where my brother is being held. I guess that's brother. Sorry about your brother, dude. <clears throat> Wait, what's there? Mm. Oh. oh, the 
it's the jail cells. Okay, maybe this is his brother then. Wait, no, don't you dare. Not until I get up here. My brother Kane is in the cell below me. Okay. My other brother, Kroon, escaped through the water tunnel under the stairs. They sacrificed my best friend Jara for Kroon's escape. Yeah, I'll follow you in a second. I do like how you can get ahead of them. What, is he just going to show me this secret tunnel? Is that what you're going to do? Come on. Show me then. I know, it's your brother. I'm sorry. What? Mm. Watch him mourn. Oh, this is no way out. It's just a... Just a t someone... <laughs> someone dug their way out to the side. Took their chances. Wow, that's interesting. Was there some other... There was some other way to go, maybe? I vaguely remember. Oh yeah, down... This tunnel does not look like it actually goes in. Oh, oh man. Do I want to do it? Yeah, I do. You bet I do. Okay, there's another way down there. Interesting. Interesting. So these are obviously the tunnels that they use to get around. Oh man, this is some complicated shit. I just want to be—I have no idea what's over there. That, and that's why I went in to cover, because I was probably gonna knew I was probably about to get shot in the back. Goddamn corpses getting in the way. That is pretty annoying. And uh, that, on the other hand, I cannot deal with. So there's an elevator. That's the... Oh, that goes all the way back up to that top grate. Okay. Alright. Getting a handle on it. Anything good in the water? There's this. Eight ball. There's a cave over there. Jesus Lord! And there's so many other paths I haven't tried yet. Okay, what's up here? Let's see what these guys are hanging out for. Nothing. Apparently this is just a like a cistern that the sewer empties into. That looks like a pipe though. Let's see. It is. So let's down the pipe, let's find out. Nothing down there. Oh, oh. Oh, and this is back out here. This is how they escaped to the bell tower. Wow, man. Man, this game. Look, there's another way. Some kind of other substructure or sewer. And I'm not even ready to, to do this. Let's, uh... I'm gonna go back. And I'm going to go in that cave. Otherwise I'm kind of stuck. I guess I can go all the way back to the top via that one elevator and make my way down a different way. I just gotta see what's over here. Oh, this is the guys that <laughs> fucked me up from before. Okay, what is my sort of shittiest weapon? These guys are easy. Oh, that hurts, doesn't it? Oh. 
feet down. Yeah, well, you know, I'm your friend here, guy. Alright, so... Uh, no, no thank you. No thank you. Evil fish. Alright, so that's all that's out here. Okay. Well, it was a net loss of nothing and a net gain of a decent amount. You know what I'm going to do? Rather than take this way out to the back bell tower, I'm going to save right here. And I'm going to take the elevator all the way back up. I'm going to explore around, and if I find anything new, I will let you guys know. I'll be back. Of course, I just remembered the big path that I didn't go down. And that was that, that this underground road, Kroon, his cross marked the way to the inner sanctum. So that sounds important, inner sanctum. And we're going to see exactly what that is. That looks like a big door that opens. Showing me some crates I would have blown up on my own anyway. Well, whatever. I appreciate it, I guess. Should really use the razor jack more. Oh, look, we're all up inside this piece now. Man, I would I was just about to just piece out of the whole level, I think. Maybe the bell tower would have let me back here. Can't bullshit a bullshitter, buddy. Main gate guard tower. Hmm. So this is the monastery proper. I will take that health, thank you. Oh, I do not like this at all. I feel that bad things will happen. I mean, I know the Nali aren't going to hurt me, but I feel that they will be hurt. That is what I'm scared of. Let's look at all the auxiliary places first. Oh, check this out. Supply crates from the Kron. Remember they said they were moving cargo from the Kron down here. Just stripping it of parts, basically. Okay, what does this do? Brings that up. Oh, hello. No way you came up on the. Okay. Jesus. Where the fuck did he get to? Oh god, I can't see shit. Oh god, no, what happened? I know what happened. Boo. Guard shipping facility power management station. Hydroelectric shipping car status off. Reactivation requires static discharge nodes to be open at top of bell tower. Oh, I see. So I should have. So the bell tower nodes need to open up. Then I assume I can restart. The shipping thing. I think that's the electric sled that what's his name was talking about. Yeah, we'll fucking do it then. Let's go. I don't know if I'll have to come back here. Oh, this is a time to save. Oh, come on. Oh well. Okay. There's still those guys in the chapel. Let me check the guard tower first, because it's the one thing I haven't done yet. I don't like 
like this. I feel like there will almost definitely be a guy on it. No. In fact, there was not. Do I hit it again, or...? Alright. Let's check out the guard tower. Maybe we can snipe someone from up here. I feel like this is one of the last places I've checked, so everyone is probably dead. Okay, so I think I just opened the main entrance. Probably. Alright. Oh, I might have been able to see it out of that very window. I wasn't an idiot. Yep, it's open now. Well, that's useless to me, but still. Okay, you crazy nolly. It's time for you to most likely die a horrible death. I'll just open everything ahead of time. Okay. Thanks, thank you. Whoa. Uh-oh. Why are there mirrors back here? That's really weird. These are the first ones in the whole game. Man, the texturing for human people wasn't always exactly the greatest. But it is what it is. <laughs> The shield belt and the armor I will certainly fucking take. That is fantastic to me. Alright, so now we do have to get to the bell tower. And it becomes of interest to me that I believe... I believe I can just jump straight the hell off. Oh, look at this. Clever. Um, land in the water. Oh, shit. Well, <sighs> that was great. I'm gonna try it. Rather than going through all the sewers and shit. Just get out here. End up in the same place. I don't know, maybe I had to hit a switch or something to open it. But, let's check it out. Oh. Magnetic locks engaged. Authorized by Captain Duke Charoth of the 12th House of Bluebervy. Shit. Shit. What lock? Where? I know the captain was mentioned in the prison log. Uh. uh this is disturbing. Well, hmm. I'm going to have to get back to you guys. I'll see you in a minute. Alright, remember how I was trying to jump these lasers using the ledge? And I was like, oh, it looks like you can't do it. What an idiot am I? What an idiot am I? Should have followed my own advice. Hydro laser control station, lasers on and operational. Lasers disengaged, access to hydroelectric generator below bell tower permitted. So, there you go. Turned off the lasers. Now we head back to the bell tower. Via the same, uh, jump the hell off the cliff <laughs> route, which I think is easily the quickest. This time I will take the ramp around the 180 of the bluff instead of falling down and hurting my shield belt again. No, don't hit that thing. Don't hit the side either. Okay. We are good. Whoa. 
I literally just like did a corkscrew in my chair trying to will myself not to hit anything on the way down. Okay. Magnetic locks engaged. What the? No. What? Okay, I'll be back. I figured it out. I remembered. Remember this catwalk place with the big underground cavern? There was more lasers down here. So when I deactivated those lasers, I deactivated these lasers. That's what I was looking for. It's a big old elevator. Oh, and it's twisting slightly. It's very disorienting in first person. Oh god. This is horrible. I... I... God damn it! God damn it! I couldn't even fucking move! <sighs> Listen, guys, that... I don't even know what to say about that. Except that... Clearly the only way to... deal with this is with the midi gun. God damn that guy. There's no room to touch those fucking rockets. And he literally just launches you in the fucking air. Where's the asshole? It's you and me, buddy. Mono a mono. Start using the rifle. <laughs> Cause I'll probably have to come back this way. Jesus, those assholes. And their rockets seem to shoot faster than mine do. Mmm. Yeah, back on all the way up. Come on out. Eat it. Okay, we're following a very huge fight here. Woo! I don't think so. Come around the corner. Backing all the way up. Yeah, I see you. Whew. Man, these guys. Okay, suddenly we're in very close quarters. here. Hmm. Whew. Man. Sure given that armor I gotta work out. Guess it's better than it could be. Bell tower magnetic locks disengaged. Access to bell tower permitted. I guess one of these guys must have been Captain... What's his nuts? Look at this giant cistern, man. Ha! 
hydroelectric shipping car, ugh, fully powered and ready for departure. Electrostatic discharge nodes atop a bell tower must be activated prior to car startup. This must be the quote unquote lightning sled. I ought to, if I was really being anal, I ought to go back and get that slime for ammo. But. Oh, and here's this lift that I was, that I saw before. How clever. Ugh. Ooh, the bell is a ringing. When the bell's a rockin', don't come and knock. Oh, that's assault armor. Yeah. Goodbye. I'll take this, thanks. Oh, 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 oh. Oh. But check it out! Yeah! Ooh, it's looking brutal now, isn't it? Orange. Shoot six at a time. That is brutality! Oh, another way up. Totally worth it, man. Yeah, I could probably actually start using the dispersion pistol as a legitimate weapon at this point. It's getting quite powerful. If I got the first couple upgrades, which I totally missed, it would be a beast by now. What the f- No, 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 no. What the fuck was that? This has to come down. I didn't hit it again by accident, did I? Must have a stupid move. <sighs> the joys of no use key. It's a lot more streamlined and whatnots, but man. Warning, static discharge nodes. Stay clear during operation. Okay, so those are the nodes themselves. This looks like poor Kira to me. Yep, science officer Kira Argmanov. Separated from my crewmates from ISV Kron, I've only been able to stay alive by holding up in this bell tower. A native Nali helped me escape the prison cell the Scarge put me in. Hopefully, the Scarge won't find me here. <sighs> Man, this game is bleak. You see the remains of everyone trying to do their best. Set up defenses, make plans, escape. Ooh, nodes on. What does this say? Static discharge successful. Hydroelectric shipping car now fully operational. Okay. It is time for us to peace the hell out of here. Oh, are we going to get a nice scenic tour of the... <laughs> oh, that was that, uh, you know, elimination pipe, whatever you want to call it. Here is that dock where I killed those brutes and fell down the first time. There's poor crucified man way out on the cliff, learning his lesson. Man, this fucking level's awesome. You just do not see FPSs with levels like this anymore. You just don't. And it's a, it's a fucking shame, because this is great. Instead we have Medal of Honor Warfighter. Warfighter, haha. <laughs> I fight the wars. 
smoke those terrorists out of their holes. I'll shine a light of justice on them. Flashlight, which I never used, probably ought to. Here we go. Deeper into the bowels of Scarge controlled Napali. Dasa Mountain Pass. That was a great level. I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. Oh man, got a stretch. Oh, my name is Cuba Libre. And I will see you all next time on Let's Play Unreal.